the uptown boy. There was a boy who noticed that people had become very, very sad. And of course, this made the boy very, very sad. He tried to make people laugh, but no mother was wonderfully, wonderfully f silly face he made. No one would smile. It was a sad world she loved. Who live? It was it was then the boy made a magical discovery. His discovery was was made of the simplest way. He had bent over his over. He has been over to pick up a ball as he bent, bent over. He saw the worry through his legs upside down. The people like the people looked like they were walking on the ceiling, and the long up the. Was being up, was now down. The long, sad frowns of the people now look like a great big smile. The boy had found an upside down world. He placed his hand on the on the floor and lift his legs high in the air. And his leg high into the air. His arm and hands and arm dig was his feet a lot has done so well before exciting. The boy began to explore the new up-down world. Now was used to be up, up, was down and what used to be down down was up the floor was the ceiling and the ceiling was the floor and the frowns were smiled and the, he was the up down boy There is good things about bad things about being a up down boy. You use there is a use gum gum that used to be down. But now was up. The goose stuck into the boy down hand. This is a bad thing. The puddles used to be down, now were up. Puddles were always a lot of fun, but little boys got in trouble when shoes walking in trouble in puddles. Shoes is hard to clean. Now what's up? Now the, that down was up. Most purples very quick, quickly were. Dirty walking hand could easily be clean. This is a good thing. The, the cat was used to be now. Now what's up to?
The cat thought the up-down boy was funny. No more ripping on the little boy's legs that could kick and bump. Now the cat rubbed on an up-down boy's cheeks and nose. Chickling, chickling nose. Oh, 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 kachoo. The puppy that lived down the street was the fastest and the sickest licker around. Now, now that down was up and up was down, the puppy, the pup, the puppy has never had so much, much to lick. Now that the he was nose to nose with the up down boy. Oh yuck! Dinner time. Still, the up down boy was whirl up and down and whirl and down was up. The table and the the chair were up. So the so the boy put his head down the chairs. He tried to eat from the table that now, now was instead up down. It could have much either had. It could have been either had had the boy has had a sandwich or a bit of fruit. There's no sandwich. There is. No fruit. That is only a bowl of up soup. The boy trying to down the soup. Oh, what a mess! The up down boy, up down the day went faster than fast. Finally, it's time to go to bed. The boy started to put on his pajamas. Oh no! Now down was up and up was down. What and what went where and how? The pajamas used used chop chop used to be on the chop were. The pajama chops went on the bottom, which used to be the top. The bottoms which used now, which were now the chops, covered the the boy's head. It was all confusing. Worse, worse than, worse than worse. People were frowning again. Their faces were turned upside down. The little boy tried to make people laugh, but no matter what silly face face he made, no one smiled. They could only frown. And so the up down boy went right side up. Now what's down was down, and what's up was up. Although he was right side up again, this story doesn't end going up down. There was a surprise waiting for the up down boy after he went right side up. Was has seemed to be frowned were really smart in this right side of world. The people had smiled when the up down boy had muddled muddled through puddles. They laughed when he slurped his soup. The People have forgotten for a time what had made them sad in our up-down world.